our first live in-person concert in 22 months. Please enjoy How Can I Keep From Singing.
Our next set features two pieces. The first, Hanukkah, was written by our friend and colleague Suzanne Sherman Prop for her chorus at Greens Farms Elementary School in Westport. The song had its debut performance in 2012 at the Unitarian Universalist Church in Stratford under the direction of Ellen Hardy, who is actually a former FCCC parent. 
We will then perform Steel Lullaby by our favorite Eric Whitaker. The lyrics are based on a tale by Rudyard Kipling, which begins with this lullaby, sung softly by a mother seal to her pup. Eric Whitaker is the Grammy-winning composer and conductor, and his groundbreaking virtual choirs, which the FCCC conductors have actually performed in and been a part of, unite musicians from over 145 different countries in song. Thank you.
Hello, my name is Ashley Zadrovitz, and I conduct the chorus of the Fairfield County Children's Choir, and I am so excited to conduct concert choir in our next piece, titled Moli Hua. Moli Hua translates to jasmine flower, and it uses a pentatonic scale, which is made up of five notes. The pentatonic scale is often found in Chinese traditional music. We first performed Moli Hua as part of the Pacific Rim Choral Festival in Hawaii in July of 2005, a tour on which Mrs. Agru Tate was a chorister. There is so much beauty in the world, such as these children singing so wonderfully during the holiday season. There is also too much hate in the world, such as that directed at Asian Americans and Pacific Islanders. We believe that it is impossible to hold hate in our hearts when we have experienced the beauty of a culture, its people, and history. Our humble response to this is to perform Moli Hua, an iconic song in Mandarin Chinese. Today, we are so excited to have the wonderful Dan Fecto joining us on violin in Moli Hua. We hope you enjoy.
pop Christmas classic, Feliz Navidad, was written in 1970 by Puerto Rican singer-songwriter Jose Feliciano. Feliciano is the recipient of the Latin Grammy Lifetime Achievement Award, and his composition has been recognized as one of the top 25 most played and recorded Christmas songs in history. The traditional Spanish Christmas and New Year greeting, Feliz Navidad, Prospero Año y Felicidad, translate, translates to wish the listeners a Merry Christmas and a prosperous Happy New Year. So, before our last selection by the concert choir, first, thank you all for attending the concert tonight, this afternoon, I should say. We, we really, really appreciate you being here, and we are so thrilled to experience live music on the stage at the Klein again after those 22 months. I am pleased to announce that we have an anonymous donor who has just offered to match donations for today up to $2,000. There are three ways that you could donate online at singfccc.org, texting FCCC to 44321. You can think of four, four choirs, and then 4321. Um, or um, to the P.O. box, mailing it to our P.O. box. And thank you so much for your continued support. At the conclusion of the next song, um, we are going to ask the audience to exit through the large doors, the exit right here in the middle of the, of the hall. Um, because of the traffic pattern and COVID regulations and everything, uh, the client has asked us to have a, an actual traffic pattern. So we ask you to exit that door. If you have a child in this choir, um, they'll be exiting the stage door right over here. So parents should go out the two doors, actually, turn to the right outside, and you can meet your chorister there. Let's see. We have some exciting concerts coming up. Um, next Saturday evening, the 11th, our chamber singers are doing a concert at St. Thomas Aquinas Church. It's a one-hour concert. It'll be some of these same selections, but many more. 
and it is a free concert sponsored by Music for Youth. The FCCC Broadway concert will, we hope, be on this stage on F Saturday evening, February 11th, and we have some uh, new plans as to how to deal with uh, the limitations to COVID and still pull off a great show there. And then, of course, our spring concert, which has now been delayed just about two years, but we do hope it will happen. We really are expecting it will happen that will move everybody down to New York City and perform on May 21st at Carnegie Hall. So we welcome you to join any of those concerts. Uh, and now, for We Need a Little Christmas, here's Mrs. Segrute one more time. <laughs> 